All right, you guys. He took it home. It's Bailey, man. Oh, oh my, my goodness. Oh, my gosh. Dude. This is insane. We've known you since a little kid, and now you're grown up, and you win a freaking TV show, man. I mean, this has been a childhood <laughs> dream of mine, and for me to be standing in this moment, like, I don't, I have, it hasn't even sunk in yet. And I'm just so grateful uh, to God uh, for guiding me here. And um, I never knew I could make it here in a million years. And, um, but I'm here, and I just don't know how to feel. And I'm just going to soak in this whole moment, for sure. One of the things you said early on in the show is that you looked up to people like Dietrix. He judged you. Uh, look up to people like Comfort, danced with her. I mean, what was it like to work with some of your idols or even, like, interact with some of your idols? I mean, we talked to Dietrix tonight. He's super, super proud of you, man. I mean, it's just a dream come true, and um, what are the odds? Because <laughs> he's been such an idol and inspiration to me, and um, for me, I felt like coming into the top 10 as a b-boy, I felt like I had to represent the people that have inspired me, um, especially the people on the show, like Comfort and uh, Fiction and um, Hawk and Dietrich, the b-boys, and um, I really wanted to represent the b-boys, and this is for y'all, for sure. We got so much love from the Filipino community that are excited not only in the Philippines, but the Filipinos around here. What do you want to say in the camera to all the Filipinos that are supporting you, and then the ones that are going to find out about you and continue to support you? Um, mabuhay, salamat po. I'm just so grateful, and um, I hope I made the Philippines proud and every Filipino out there, for sure. Yeah, the, we're gonna be, they're going to be watching this in the Philippines, and they love to see people. Um, what, what is it like to be a Filipino representation? I mean, you know, you, you have Dietrich as a judge. You have you winning it. Like, a lot of Filipinos grow up and may not think that they can be a dancer for a profession, and you guys change the game. What do you think it's like for, for Filipinos to watch the show tonight and just see all that representation? I'm just so humbled to somewhat have a country behind me and um, to represent my culture, which and heritage I truly adore, and all my family and stuff. And um, it just means the world, and it's just crazy to think that. You made so many, you touched so many hearts. I mean, one of the things is you have people all walks of life watching the show, and you were able to sell B-Boy to middle America, to old people and stuff, so they voted and won. What did it mean to have so many people around the world being touched by your story? You had Mary Murphy crying, you had all these people crying. What is it like to, to touch everybody's hearts? I mean, every time I step on stage, like, I just leave my heart on there. And um, I felt like coming into this competition, I had to represent myself. But I felt like it was bigger than myself. And I represented my family, God, and um, the Filipinos, the B-boys. There was so much that I felt like I had to represent. And hopefully I made everyone proud. And to be standing here in this moment is just no words. You're going on tour, man. You're going on tour. So what do we bring? What are the two items you have to bring on tour with you? What are the two? Yeah, toothbrush. Okay, toothbrush. 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 And um, I don't know. Neck pillow? Neck pillow. Yes, very smart. I right? bring a neck pillow <laughs> everywhere. You ask anybody, I always bring a neck pillow. Yes. What, what stop are you most excited to go to on tour? Um, I'm so excited to go to different cities obviously yeah. but las vegas yes I mean, you gotta represent in the bay area i bay mean area. those are my hometown so i'm so excited for that lastly what's next for you what do you hope once the tour is done and all this is done what do you hope for next oh. in your career i'm just gonna enjoy this moment but surprisingly i would actually love to go back to the philippines yeah you gotta Shoot. come they want yeah. to see you and visit up yeah absolutely real quick uh what are you gonna do to celebrate tonight um spend time with my family Absolutely. Good answer. All right, you guys, we've known Bailey forever. He took it home tonight. He's the season 16 winner of So You Think You Could Dance. We're so proud of you, man. Everybody in our team is texting me who won, who won, and it was nice to text your name. So support you this so guy. Much. He's got big things on the horizons. Congratulations, love man. Love you. Thank you Peace. so much. Peace. Got much love. Peace.